Russians advanced up to two kilometers in some areas of front, but this has cost them dearly. Since the 10th of October, Russian troops have advanced 1.5 to 2 kilometers in some areas of the front in the area of responsibility of the Tavria Operational Strategic Group. Alexander Stupun, spokesperson for the Ukrainian Defense Forces on the Tavria Front, said this. Since the 10th of October, when the enemy became more active, it has advanced by 1.5 to 2 kilometers in some places, but this has cost the Russians dearly. In a little over two months, the enemy has lost almost 25,000 people killed and wounded in Donetsk Oblast alone, in the area of responsibility of the Tavria Operational Strategic Group, and about 200 tanks and more than 400 other armored vehicles have been destroyed. 80% of this happened on the Avdiivka front, he added. Stupun added that the Russians have the advantage in terms of manpower. So intense fighting continues around the eastern Ukrainian city of Avdiivka as Russian forces advance with high reported losses while Kyiv pivots to a defensive winter strategy and Moscow ramps up its nationwide bombing campaign. Russian forces are currently advancing around the flanks of the settlement, which sits just outside the Russian-occupied Donbass city of Donetsk. Russia appears to be trying to close a noose around Avdiivka, bringing the western approach routes to the embattled city under fire control and preventing reinforcements.